Hi, this is Mike Haber. Thank you for asking me, how do I beat an MIP or a minor in possession case? There are standard defenses that we defense lawyers use in all criminal cases. But if you're under 21 and you're accused of being an MIP, then you might just enjoy one of the four following specialty defenses that are specific to this type of a charge. The first is called temporary possession. If you, a minor, are handed alcohol for the sole purpose of passing the container to someone else, or if you were asked by someone else to merely hold it for them, then you may not have been in legal possession because you only took momentary, temporary, or transistory possession of the poos, and you didn't exercise complete dominion and control, which is an essential element of legal possession over the alcohol in question. Constructive possession is number two. If an alcoholic beverage is neither in your hand nor on your person, for example, let's say it's sitting in between you and somebody else in the center console of a car, or if it's on a table, then in order to nail you, the state's going to have to prove that you knew that the booze was where it was, that you knew that the booze was in fact booze, and that you could have exercised dominion and control over it had you chosen to do so. Three, if you're in between the ages of 18 and 20, you may be a lawfully employed service employee, making it perfectly legal for you to possess, although not to consume, alcoholic beverages. It's got to be within your scope of employment for this to apply. Finally, number four, FS 5610414A requires an alcoholic beverage contain at least a half of 1% of alcohol by volume. So if it contains less than that amount of alcohol, it's a non-alcoholic beverage, and it's perfectly legal for a minor to possess. So if your MIP is based on a mixed drink and the cops fail to secure it as evidence, and they don't test it, the state may very well have a proof problem in your case. Thank you for your question. I appreciate your having asked it, and I invite you to ask me more. Please remember at Haber PA, it's all about reasonable doubt. And if you like this video, please subscribe. We'll be putting out more soon.